Was it good? No, he was horrible. It's supposed to hurt when it's your first time. It was so bad. I hated it. Oh, man. And it was so small. It was tiny. Like it was the fourth person. <laughs> What's up guys, so tonight I'm downtown McAllen and I'm gonna be asking people to tell me how they lost their virginity. But real quick guys, before we get into the video, I wanna give a huge shout out to the sponsor of this video and that's Manscaped. Now Manscaped has personally hooked me up with a lot of cool stuff from their all-in-one performance package 4.0, so let's check it out. Now the first thing to highlight in the performance package 4.0 kit is the Lawnmower 4.0 body trimmer. This is Manscaped's fourth generation electric waterproof trimmer with advanced skin safe technology, which reduces nicks and cuts on the most sensitive regions of the body. Now also included in the performance package 4.0 kit are two products I bet you didn't know you needed until now. The Crop Preserver Ball Deodorant and the Crop Reviver Ball Toner Spray. Now you know Manscaped really has you covered from head to toe because in the performance package there's also the Weed Whacker nose and ear hair trimmer. Now for a limited time you're going to get all of this plus two free gifts. The Shed Travel Bag and the Manscaped Anti-Chafing Boxer Briefs. Alright guys now if you click the link in the description box below you're going to get 20% off your Manscaped order. You're also going to get free international shipping and you're going to get your two free gifts. So don't miss out on this opportunity. Get your Manscaped. Make sure you're using the right tools for the job to keep everything fresh and clean below the belt. Manscaped, you're not gonna regret it, guys. Let's get to this video. Oh, how'd you lose your virginity? Oh, dude, it was my eighth grade prom, bro. But I didn't know what I was doing. I want prom king, too. Great night. I always watch your videos. I got surgery on my tonsils, and like all I watched was you, like, literally. Yeah, I mean, for real, like, Yo, you should like subscribe to him and like follow him and everything. Like literally. Hey, if you get your tonsils removed, watch my videos. Yeah, yeah. It hurts a lot, but you know, it's worth it. I'm gonna remember it at a mall in a parking lot in my truck car. Craziest thing ever, cause like there was like a car next to us and they had the windows down. Yeah, I was like, sorry, but hey, 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 I gotta do what I gotta do, you know? Was it good? Nah, it wasn't. It really wasn't. Like, okay. it was like, I'm sorry, but. <laughs> It was like, damn, I'm sorry. Yeah, I had a boyfriend. He was ugly, but he, I could have been in the back seat. I don't remember exactly where, but. No se me quería parar. So I was like, what the, like, I was like, bro, come on. Like, so, pasó, pasó un ratito más, so la puse ya, la perdí como a los 14 por ahí. My first boyfriend, freshman year, he took me to an empty parking lot. <laughs> It's a lot of parking lot stories. Yeah, we had sex in the car. Was it good? Was it bad? It was, I mean, it was my first time, so I didn't know any better, but I guess yeah, it was pretty good. <laughs> I've had better since then, but. <laughs> but. Yes, talk to me. I want to know, how'd you lose your virginity? Oh my, which one? <laughs> all of them. Which one? Wait, oh my God, that's a really good story. Well, first of all, I was five years old. My uncle, he used to, yes, my, it was my uncle, which I love and I appreciate and I miss him so much. He was my first love. Five years old, yes, yes. Otherwise, it's when I was straight, when I was a man. I was 12 years old. It was with, uh, her name was Angelica. She was my neighbor. We used to, I don't want to go, but we were like um, in, the, in her closet. We were playing truth or dare. And then I licked her boobs. For real, I swear, I used and to like her. 12? I was, yes, uh, maybe even younger. And we were, and, and I would lick her boobs. For real, and I'd be like, like this, like, like that. I used to like girls and stuff. I used to, I don't know what happened. I, I don't know what happened. <laughs> Hey man, high school, I was just doing stupid shit. It was like, fuck it, you know? But I finished fast as fuck, bro. <laughs> it wasn't even good, bro. But you know what? I learned since then, you know? Oh, yeah. Like, I've learned to adapt to every girl, and I find the perfect spot every time. That first time was the Worst time, but every time has been the best. It gets better. It gets better, I, and it's been the best every time. I hit a new, I hit a new level. How'd you lose your virginity? I still haven't. I haven't. I haven't. You I'm, know how many times I've heard that on this street. I'm not. First of all, I'm not from here. I'm not like these other girls. Um, but I'm waiting. 
I like to dress like a thug. Right, in the back of my fucking truck, dog. Was it spacious? It was pretty spacious, no cap, dog. Oh, I lost it in a um, in a car in the back seat of a like we were like in a in a trash uh, by like the movies in the dumpster. We were like parked in the back. I know it was super weird. Super weird. Was it good though? His dick was too small. It didn't it didn't like do nothing. It didn't it hit. Weird. It didn't hit right. No! It was like real weird. At the beach. At the beach. <laughs> and yeah, no like way. no way. Yeah, it is, but it was trash. Did y'all get sand all over? No, because we had like blankets on the floor. Oh, okay. yeah. Guys with little dicks are a waste of time. Yeah. Trash. Don't fuck with guys with little dicks. Straight trash. Straight trash. Who's your virginity? And una pincha trailer in Houston. Después de una quinceañera. It was scary. I mean, it was my first time. Like, what do you expect? I didn't know what was going on, you know? How'd you lose your virginity? <laughs> oh, I can't answer that, dog. Where were you? I was in my truck. It was it was good. Uh, I had no condom though. That's scary. It was. She she tricked me after. She said that um that she was pregnant. Que no salen de downtown. Yo si salgo de downtown. You want me to tell you? It's our little secret. Okay, tell me. I'm a virgin. Don't lie. I'm a virgin. You promise? I promise. I'm a virgin. What are you doing downtown? It's my birthday. How old are you turning? 21. Not a virgin. I'm a virgin. Pulas pinches mentiras. How'd I lose it? I rode a fucking bike in seventh grade all the way to Shadi's crib in the rain. Hey, in that's a dedication. Bike. Bike. Dedication. I fucking dedicated. Ain't no one more dedicated than me. Ooh, we did it at my crib, and I was probably like 16, 15, and you know I'm young. I'm feeling fucking crazy, so I hit on my friends, and I'm like, yo, I just lost my virginity to this girl. Dated for a few years. And I find out she ain't shit. Some girls are not always worth it, you know? I lost my virginity with her at 20 years old. I'm 24 right now. And she's the woman I've been with ever since. You lose your virginity. Oh, oh I'm virgin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm virgin. 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 Cool. On the alley. When I was like around 17, 17 or 18. But it was some wild stuff, man. I'm telling you right now. That shit was some slime dime type of shit. Hey, <laughs> hey, I saw you on Mario's show, bro. Hey, oh, hey okay. shout out to Steven Friends. Neta, a chile wey, verga. Thank you. That's all I gotta say, right? Oh. Thank you. In a church parking lot, bro. How'd y'all lose your virginity? <sighs> Unfortunately, I thought I fell in love with somebody, and I thought he was the one, and I said, fuck it, I'm gonna do it with him, and I did it with him. Was it good? No, he was horrible. No, it was my first time, so, like, it hurt, right? It's supposed to hurt when it's your first time. So I cried a lot. My first time, I just wanted to get it over with. So I just, it was a guy from my high school. It was so bad. I hated it. Man. And it was so small. It was tiny. You're it like was the fourth person. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> but I oh, fell in love. love. I don't know. I thought he was the one. Yeah, never. never the no, one in the he's never the one. Never. He's never one in the valley. Don't fucking trust no guys. Man, I lost my virginia in high school to an older ass lady, bro. But she was me i wasn't fucking her bro that that's how it went bro she I, sat you down and she you no no up. she sat me down bro i was scared that i busted a nut in her that, that's how a virgin i was mother come on now hey i like i like i like that knife I, yeah, yeah, homeboy oh, no mama hey, homeboy took my shit really like that knife i said i don't know what y'all talking about but watch this watch this watch this what's he gonna do watch this I'm a virgin. Don't lie. I'm a virgin. I'm a virgin. I'm a virgin. I'm a virgin. Uh, I got raped. <laughs> I got raped. Hey, when I was in Mexico, what part? Michoacan, the Tierra Caliente. Was it good? Not really, because it was hairy. Uh, hey, you know over there, they don't shave. Oh. Give me a fucking big ass cutter. Uh, you guys want to lose your virginity, you want to do this, you want to do that. Guys, keep it simple, keep it plain, keep it G. Keep it Hoodville. You can't whoever, you have too much pride in you and yourself in the valley, in the valle. Look at this, bro. I lost my virginity. We did what we did. I'm here now. It's the Mullet Boys, man. We're here back in 2022.
It was like we planned it. It was planned yeah. on the calendar and everything. Did you light a candle? A white candle. Did you have your favorite song? Spiritual, no. I don't remember. It's a long time ago. Fernando, fixa la verga! If you grew up in my generation, Gen Z, by the way, we were some horny bitches. She lived next to my house. I swear to God, it was probably like a 10 minute walk. She lived in a trade park next to my house, bro. Like, hey, whoa, whoa, what the fuck? But I think it was bad because I didn't know my shit. You know, you lose your virginity. You lose your virginity. Hey, bro. Me? Hey, bro. I lost it in the movies. I was like 14, 15. Uh, we had sex with one of my homeboys, my best friend, Adrian Guerrero's car. I, I stained the little seat a little bit, so the next day I had to clean it, but I didn't clean it, he did. So, I mean, it happened. That's a good friend. Oh, that's a very best friend. That's one of my best friends ever, bro. But, I mean, put on FS6, that's the way it goes. Hey, so fuck shout it. out Adrian. Hey, shout out Adrian Guerrero from the A from Adrian Guerrero, you were a homie. Follow me on motherfucking Facebook, Julio Rodriguez. Me enamoré de un chacal de Monterrey. Y él me bajó, me bajó el cielo y las estrellas. Entonces... Una vez después del live out en Monterrey, rentamos un Airbnb y pues me cochó y pues así la historia. How'd you lose your virginity? Ay no, que tenía 14 y con un pinche vato que no vale verga. Was it good or bad? Bad. How long did it last? Ay, como unos pinche una hora a la verga. Chile, I regret it a la verga. How'd you lose yours? In a room. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Bitch, yes. In a room. It wasn't fun. It was boring. Like we had to hide from his parents. It's like, better now. Yes. You have to hide from your yes. Parents. Is it Wait. better now? Yes. It's better. Uh, <laughs> oh, nine five six. Está con madre. JC. Somebody to knock somebody out. I might have to pull up the whole thing. I might have to go take the whole thing. This is where we meet. See